The Berlin Wall stood for nearly three decades as a stark symbol of division between East and West, communism and democracy, and oppression and freedom. Its fall on November 9, 1989, marked one of the most dramatic turning points in modern history. But how did this monumental event come to pass? After World War II, Germany was divided into East and West. The Soviet-controlled East became a communist state, while the West aligned with democratic nations. Berlin, the capital, was also divided, even though it was entirely within East Germany. By the 1950s, East Germans were fleeing to the West in massive numbers, seeking freedom and economic opportunities. To stop this exodus, East Germany erected the Berlin Wall in 1961, cutting off East Berlin from the rest of the world. The wall wasn't just a physical barrier, it was a powerful political statement. Families were separated, lives were disrupted, and East Berlin became a symbol of Cold War oppression. Guards patrolled the wall, and escape attempts were met with deadly force. Over 100 people lost their lives trying to cross it. By the 1980s, cracks in the communist world were beginning to show. The Soviet Union, under Mikhail Gorbachev, introduced reforms like glasnost, openness, and perestroika restructuring. These changes weakened Soviet influence over Eastern Europe. In East Germany, dissatisfaction was growing, economic stagnation, a lack of freedoms, and the desire for reunification fueled protests across the country. In the summer of 1989, Hungary opened its border with Austria, creating a hole in the Iron Curtain. Thousands of East Germans fled to the West through this route, putting immense pressure on East Germany's communist regime. Demonstrations grew larger and louder, with chants of We Are The People, demanding change. The tipping point came on November 9, 1989. A miscommunication during a press conference led an East German official to announce that border crossings would be allowed immediately. Crowds gathered at the Berlin Wall, demanding to be let through. Overwhelmed, border guards eventually opened the gates. East and West Berliners poured through, climbing the wall, celebrating, and chipping away pieces as souvenirs. The images of people dismantling the wall with hammers and their bare hands became iconic, symbolizing the triumph of unity over division. Within a year, Germany was reunified, and the Cold War began to wind down. The fall of the Berlin Wall didn't just reunite a city, it signaled the end of communist regimes across Eastern Europe and a new era of freedom and democracy. It remains a powerful reminder that walls, no matter how strong, cannot stand against the will of the people. What lessons do you think the fall of the Berlin Wall holds for us today? Share your thoughts in the comments, and don't forget to subscribe for more stories that shape the modern world.